Hello everyone, Caller on the way here, and welcome back to another Pixel Gun 3 weapon review. And today's weapon review is not a new weapon in Pixel Gun 3D, it is a weapon called the Firestarter. Now, the Firestarter has gotten a couple of upgrades uh, in this new 12.6.0 update. And this Firestarter is a really good area damage weapon in the heavy section now. Re really happy that they buffed the Firestarter. It used to be really underpowered. It used to be like a 5 shot kill to take someone out with max armor. This weapon is now a 2 shot kill to a max armor player, so. Definitely a heck of a lot better than it was before, and it's a heck of a lot of fun to you guys. F fun to use, guys. Uh, this weapon, uh, you know, with the new upgrade system, like each upgrade for this weapon, it costs like ten gems, and you can have to upgrade this weapon like six times. So, it's sixty gems to upgrade this weapon to the max. So, if you are a OG Pixel Gun 3D player and you play this game for a very long time, uh, you might have this weapon, and you can actually use get get the weapon. Um, you just upgrade again and stuff. Make it a lot better than it was before. I'm actually going to use this thing here. Because uh, Guardian does not kill me when I have that thing. But, yeah guys. Uh, this weapon is a two-shot kill. Perfect example right there. That guy had max armor in the game. And it's definitely a really good weapon, guys. Definitely do recommend upgrading this weapon. If you do have it purchased, I'm not too sure if you can actually buy this weapon in the shop anymore. But, um, you know, if this is like a new event in Pixel Gun 3D, you can probably get this weapon. So definitely get this weapon while you can, guys. It's a really good weapon. Kind of a necessity, well not too much, but definitely a pretty good weapon, guys. Definitely do recommend getting it. Can't stress that enough, guys, because this weapon, uh, there's some things I knew do need to, to um, note with this weapon. Um, this weapon only has 10 shots, so you'll eventually pretty fast actually run out of ammo with the fire starter. So definitely do re really need to note about the fire starter. You will run out of ammo since you only have one bullet and nine uh, reserving, so... Definitely pay attention of when you're actually hitting the player. Be very accurate. This thing is a two shot to take out a turret also, guys. So, um, but yeah, you can see that it's actually a really powerful weapon. Definitely a lot better than it was before. Two shot, killing these players easily. Like in two shots. It's really powerful, guys. Can't beat the big buddy sometimes. Since the big buddy person, like against the big buddy, if that person actually misses, you can actually get the person if you're accurate enough. So, yeah, guys, uh, definitely do recommend getting the Fire Starter. It's definitely a really highly recommend getting weapon getting, actually. Because this weapon takes a bit more skill than most of the other area damage weapons. Because you have to be really accurate with your shots. And, you know, with something like the Solar Power Cannon, you have, like, four, 50 shots in your in your magazine before dying. So, you can pretty much miss, like, 10 shots in a row. And you'll still get the person what you're trying to kill. Trying to kill. Alright. So, two shot there. That's another example. Get the ammo drops on the ground, um, if you guys can see them, but you probably are going to die. I have not died in a while, actually. Hold on. Maybe I can get... Oh, there's another one. There's another one here. You can find some ammo drops on the ground. That's something that's also good. Of course, I just wasted both of those. But, uh, um, I might just let someone kill me now, because I actually need some more shots here. Please don't... Come on, man. Don't miss with your laser mounter. Thank you. But, um, yeah, guys, uh, fire starter... If I rate this weapon from 1 to 10, you know, your big body being a 10 or something like that. This weapon is probably like an 8.5 out of 10. Um, definitely one of the better area damage weapons that does require skill for sure. But, uh, yeah, this weapon, I feel like it doesn't have that much of area damage effect. as something like the Solar Power Cannon, because the Solar Power Cannon does have the most amount of area damage in Pixel Gun 3D. It has the most area damage, and this weapon doesn't have as much at all. But, uh... It's not, it doesn't really matter that much, really. But, uh, yeah, guys, Firestarter review, gonna do this match. I don't know what the heck that was. I was aiming right at him, but my screen aimed down for some reason. I don't know what happened there. But, uh, yeah, guys, um, really powerful weapon. Do recommend getting it. And let's just do an, a match here with this amazing Firestarter. I don't think I need, I don't think I need anything else I need to say for this weapon. But, uh, let's just get some kills, guys. Let's see how many we can get. Oh, this guy right, right here. Exotic, uh, whatever that guy's name is. I didn't read it. All right, let's get this guy right here. Whatever his name is. Okay. But, uh, yeah, guys, um, always watch out for those other weapons people are using in this map. Sound School might, might be your best bet. You know, close range matches, Sound School, people are using the one shot kill sniper rifles like the laser bouncer and stuff. Even though the weapon is a sniper rifle, it acts like one. So, always watch out and always move around a lot. For, make, out, make it harder for people to hit you. Definitely a uh, uh, daily tip for Pixel Gun now these days. Uh, we got that guy. We get Exotic 750. I don't know why that did not kill him. Sometimes it's a three shot for some reason. Um, if they have like the Berserk Cape on. You know, if you have the Berserk Cape in Pixel Gun 3D, it makes you have more armor. 
and it can cause this weapon to be a three shot. So I guess the Berserk Cape person, you know, the Berserk Cape is a three shot kill. So always, um, you know, most people don't have that on, so it doesn't really, it's not really that much of a big deal. So let's get this guy or not. Unfortunately, that guy took my kill. But uh, yeah, Sound of School may be a bit of trouble with some with this weapon. Um, it depends on what players are actually going against. You know, everyone has sniper rivals that are one are the most powerful in the game. It's going to be a diff bit difficult. But yeah, guys, I'm not doing too bad. I'm third place right now. When only two minutes in the game, so not too bad. Okay, of course I keep keep dying, you know. But as you can see here, one shot. Why is this not killing, man? Okay, there we go. I don't know why it's not. That, that should have been a two shot. I don't know why that's not working. Hold on, I'm actually gonna do. Okay, let's see what we can do here. See what kills we can actually get with this weapon. I kind of want to get some good gameplay right now. In the mood to do so. I was actually kind of lucky today to actually record a video today. I was planning on pre-recording videos for the rest of this week. But, unfortunately, I was not... I thought I was not able to. But I actually got home in time to actually record one video. So, that's... Okay. I guess it's better than nothing. So, alright, come on. Let's get this guy right here. Get Obey. There we go. Got him. And get this guy with his judge. Um, stands no chance against this thing. If the person has bad aim with the judge, you're gonna kill him pretty easily because that guy's not even moving. So get this guy with a smart bow bazooka. Why is this thing not? Sometimes I don't understand why this weapon's a three shot. Sometimes when it's supposed to be a two shot, but uh, I'll just say this weapon's a two to three shot sometimes. But most of the time, a two shot kill, definitely really reliable. So let's get this guy right here. And get this guy, August. That's a subscriber of mine. And get Obey. There we go. Got another kill with this weapon. You can get a lot of kills. You're really accurate with a fire starter. You have to be really accurate because you only you don't have that many shots with this weapon. So always be accurate with this thing. There we go. We got to Obey again. That's my main target. Not too far away from first place, but I'm not going to win because you're not going to be using this weapon normally when you're not recording your video for the whole length of the match for sure. That's something that I don't expect people to do. Use one single weapon for an entire link of a match. Unless it's probably something like the nanobot rifle. But, uh, yeah, guys, uh, that's pretty much it for the video. If you guys did enjoy this Firestarter review, D-Max upgraded Firestarter review, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Comment down below um, other videos you guys want me to do. And subscribe for more Pixel Gun 3D content on this channel. Guys, make sure you guys leave a like for more content on this channel. It's definitely a lot of fun to record videos on. Not really much of a problem for me. And, uh, yeah, guys, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.